Hey guys, how's it going? Today, in this video, I'm going to give you a quick review of this Silk Gold 3D printer 1.5 millimeter PLA filament. So, let's get started. Okay, so the first thing I like to do when reviewing a product is head over to the landing page where I purchased the product. So I bought this on Amazon and here is the listing page. And it does come out to 54 cents an ounce. Um, and I think this is a pretty good price considering other filaments, just white and black, are around 40 cents an ounce. But when you get to some of these gold right here and this silver this is almost 70 cents an ounce this is 65 cents an ounce and this one is only 54 cents an ounce so it's a more budget friendly um, filament which I enjoy but the color um, looks amazing which I'm gonna get to in a little later in this video but so anyways this was a 2.2 pound spool for $19 um, and I wanted it to do some trophies and do some coins and do some plaques to give some friends and gifts, things of that nature, trophies when we're playing Mario Kart, um, just fun little things like that. And I wanted a gold filament to be able to print things like that. Um, and this was the best bang for my buck that also looked like something shiny, like what I wanted it to look like. Um, so I went ahead and tried this product out, but I'm going to say that I was not disappointed at all. And I'm going to get into that, of course, later in this review. All right, so here is that actual gold filament. And on the roll, it even looks just as nice as it does printed. Um, these print, honestly, amazing in my opinion. They look better than any other part of printed. The multicolor, the plain black, the paint, plain white. Um, this gold and the, the glare it gives off the shine is just awesome. I don't know if you guys can see it very good in the way the shadows um, reflect off it, but it is a very awesome filament to look at. Um, it does print at 210 degrees Celsius, plus or minus 15 degrees. Um, and it's a 1.75 millimeter, which most printers that comes standard. But now let's get a little bit into the color and the details on this. So this is a coin I printed and you can just see as I turn the reflections and the shadows and how good it looks. This is another one. There's the back. My printer obviously was not level for that print very well. But the front too, again, you can just see the shadows go off that. And then here is a trophy I printed, a fun little Mario Kart trophy. And you can even read the name in there so clearly because of the way it reflects light. If this was just a black or gray part or white part, you would not be able to read that name Mario Kart as clearly as you would with this um, really reflective gold filament. So I really do enjoy this filament. Um, it's exactly what I wanted when I was looking for a gold filament that had some reflective qualities to it and has a little bit of shine. Um, so if you guys were on the fence about buying this filament or just really wanted to be pointed in the right direction um, when you're shopping for a gold filament, I'd say this one is an easy, easy yes for me and a good pickup for you. And then real quickly, I'm going to put up some shots with a better quality camera to show you the metallic features um, and shadows on these prints. So again, I love how this print looks. It's probably one of my favorite filaments that I have, and I'm going to continue to use it for projects like this, coins, trophies, and plaques, because um, the shine it gives makes it almost look real. Um, not, not like real gold, but like a real metallic surface. That's it for this video guys. Thanks for watching. Just a quick video showing you what I think about this silk gold PLA filament. So if I were you and I was on the fence about getting this, I would get it because it is awesome. So again guys, that's it for this video. Thanks for watching.